plants, especially the ones we grow for food, are awesome. As gardeners, that's not something we really need convincing of. From life cycles that burn brightly, giving up all the goods in a single season, to others that keep going year after year, albeit with a few breaks in between. Hi, I'm Jeff from the Ripe Tomato Farms. Welcome back to another episode of The Garden Quickie, the show where in two minutes or less, there's nothing wrong with taking a little break. And today's episode is all about those breaks. More specifically, plant dormancy. Why do they do it? What's the point? Time short as you know it is, so let's dive in. If the conditions are just right, many plants will go about their business for years and years without a care in the world. We call these plants perennials. Trees are the most perfect example of this. Evergreen stalwarts grown in situ for decades. But even within that great group of plants, there lie specimens that go dormant. Like this cherry tree here. And that's because not all plants can weather the winter in an actively growing state. To combat the cold, they gotta go dormant. If certain plants, like this blueberry bush here, were to remain actively growing when the real cold hits, water in the stems and leaves would freeze and rupture their cells. Kind of like our irrigation lines. In short, dormancy is a survival mechanism for our plants. The certain plants that want to or have to grow longer than a single season to complete their life cycle, but cannot survive the winter in an actively growing state. Basically, it's a hibernation for plants, and it's triggered by a drop in temperatures coupled with less hours of less light intensity. A well-deserved break for our crops that are going to be sprouting back to life this spring. Like this strawberry plant here. Hey, quite likely we'll be taking a break too, but just for the holidays. Don't worry, we'll be back well before spring starts. Thanks for watching guys. And hey, if garden quickies are your thing, make sure to subscribe and click on this playlist here as we explore and solve more growing issues in two minutes or less.